news. In today's video, we are going to be going royal custom content shopping. So I've never done a video like this before, but it has been highly requested. So in this video, you guys will be able to see what sites I use, and then I will link what I download in a Tumblr post and link that in the description below. So you might wanna have a pen just so you know what number things are. If you don't know how to download custom content, I will link a video to a tutorial in the description below. And then if you are playing The Sims 4 on console, unfortunately you can't download custom content. I'm so sorry, this is only for Mac and PC users. If you are new to my channel, I have a royal family series and my brand has kind of become royals. So that's why we're going royal custom content shopping and finding crowns and ball gowns and like everyday outfits for royals and all that kind of stuff. So it's gonna be a lot of fun. So if you're excited for this video, make sure you hit that like button and let's go ahead and begin. All right, now the first website I use is The Sims Resource. I get so much stuff from here. I am also a member on here and I highly recommend being a member if you can. It's like $4 a month. This way you can actually search for things and there is no wait time when you download stuff as well. So it's just really just like anything I see I'm gonna get. Like this one right here automatically I'm gonna get. This is by Sifix so I need to go to their page because I get so much stuff from here. This I definitely want to get. They always come in a bunch of different color swatches. Like it actually has purple and pink for Windenburg too which is great. This just looks like a really nice everyday outfit for maybe Queen Amira, maybe Queen Evangeline. So I'm gonna download this one and then I'm going to link this one as well. So this is the first one that we got and I just have my little Google Doc right here of all our links and everything. But they have so much stuff. Most of this is on my Pinterest board. I do have a Pinterest board of my royal custom content. I do have this dress for Amira as well. It's called Serena Dress, but I definitely recommend their page and downloading their stuff because they have so much stuff for royals. Some of it is a little bit more revealing, so I don't download the revealing stuff just because I feel like royals wouldn't wear that kind of stuff, but I already have everything else, so I'm just gonna download this one for now and link that. But at least you guys can see their profile and all their stuff, so just remember Sifix. I never really get hairs from here. I get them from other creators who we will see as well, but I mostly just see alpha hairs on The Sims resource, and I don't use alpha hair. I use some other alpha custom content, but not for hair. I'm not really seeing too much on their featured content. I'm already on like page 16 and haven't seen too much. So why don't I type in gown in search? So I don't think you can search unless you are a member. And a lot of this, there is a good chance I already have. Oh, this is cute. I haven't seen this one yet. Most of this I have seen, but not this one. So let me grab this one as well. So this will be number two. Ooh, there's this one. This is a little bit darker, but I like that one. Oh, it comes in three color variations. Okay, cool. This is gonna be number three then. I love this one. So another creator that I recommend is John Sims. So they have their own website as well as a profile on The Sims resource. This one is cute. This one kind of looks like Princess Diana's dress, but like a different version in a different pattern. So I'm gonna download this one too. This is a cute little everyday outfit. So this one will be number four. Another one is Elf Door. So this is a good one as well. This one looks good. Oh, this is interesting. It looks like the bottom of it. I'm not 100% sure if I'm gonna like the texture of it, but I'm just gonna download it because it looks nice. So you guys can decide if you like it or not, but I'm gonna put this one in there as well. So this is number five. We'll get into like the crowns and stuff in just a second. But yeah, they got a lot of good stuff. Okay, I must've cleared out the Sims resource because everything I either have already or don't like. So we're gonna move on to another website. So I would recommend also looking at Maxis Match CC World on Tumblr. Obviously, if you like Maxis Match, they reblogged this one. So this is Sateen Gown by Sim Mandy. So I'm gonna download this. This is so, pr oh, this comes with the hair too. So this is a hair and a dress. Okay, so this one is going to be number six. Ooh, this hair is cute. All right, so we're getting into some of the hairs now. But this one is called Sabrina. This is number seven. That is the Sabrina hair. Ooh, this one's cute. This is like beach waves. I like this one. This is called Steel by Sim Mandy. So that one also we're just gonna put here. This is number eight. Yeah, some of this I guess doesn't have to be for royal custom content specifically, but that's basically the theme I'm going for here. Oh my God, I'm finding so many hairs here. This one is called Puzzle by Samandi. This one is number nine. Ooh, I like this one. This one's called Royal Rumbles. There you go, Royal. I'm gonna download. Oh, this one has a mesh too. Oh, I think, okay. So there's the mesh and then there's also like the other colors too. I'm gonna download the mesh. The mesh is number 10. Okay, I actually really love this one. This is like little cute French braids. That one is called Peachy Hair and that is number 11. Ooh, ooh, this one might be cute. This one is called Sea 
Seafoam. Oh yeah, I like this one. Okay, Seafoam download. Okay, so Seafoam hair, that's pretty. This was number 12. Okay, I think that's enough of the hairs for now. So next I'm gonna go to Bats from Westeros because this is where I get all of my crowns and like so much custom content from here. Okay, so we do have a new one I see because most of their stuff I have, but uh, they have a royal uniform. It does say that the mesh is here. So let's find that. Ooh, this is, ooh, cool. Okay, so royal uniform, download link. So actually this is really nice. So I'm just gonna put this one as number 13 and then I'll put Bats from Westeros version. So yeah, this is Bats from Westeros version. This one will be number 14. Oh cool, they have a state banquet suit. Oh my God, this is great. Okay, download. Oh good, I'm glad we're finding some good stuff for the men. This one is number 15. Oh my gosh, this is gorgeous. <gasps> this is a new crown that I don't have. Oh my God, okay, download. That is so pretty. It's called Indian Cartier. It even has like a little backstory behind it too. That is so, oh my God, that is beautiful. Bats, if you're watching this, this is amazing. Oh, sorry, that one is number, that was number 16. Did you have a diamond choker too? This is gorgeous. Oh my God, that is so, so pretty. Okay, this diamond choker, this one is number 17. Do I have this one? I don't know if I do. I don't think I do. I'm gonna download it. It looks kind of similar to one of the other ones that Bats has. This one's number 18, but I'm gonna download this one anyway. So I think I've caught up on everything. This is Princess Margaret pack. This this has a beautiful necklace and beautiful gowns. They are so, so pretty. I'm going to just add this one to the list. I already have it, but I'll add it anyway. So this one's going to be number 19. That's the Princess Margaret pack. Yeah, make sure you go check out his Tumblr. It's called Bats from Westeros and just look through all their stuff. They're amazing. Most of the stuff I already have. So that's all I'm gonna look at on his Tumblr today. So the next Tumblr I'm looking at is the Royal Vault. They have so much. So basically like they're reblogging some of Bats from Westeros stuff. Stuff. Yeah, that's the crown that we had just seen. And then, ooh, these sapphires though. I want these, uh, the sapphire necklace and the sapphire earrings. So they're called Queen Consort Alexandra's Sapphires. So this one I am, ooh, whoa. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna add these. Ooh, oh, these come with crowns too. Okay, download here, download here. Okay, well, I'm going to link this Tumblr post for the sapphires. And it looks like it comes with crowns and stuff too, but that one's number 20. Okay, so this is the Kent Festoon Tier. It's beautiful. I'm gonna download that. This one's number 21. I actually found this one on, this is from Bats from Westeros, but I didn't realize I don't have this one. So this is another tiara. This one's called the Northumberland Diamond Festoon. This one is number 22. Then there's this necklace and these earrings. This one is by, this is by Normal Sims. So I'm gonna do this one as well. This necklace and the whole jewelry set. This one's gonna be number 23. This one is gorgeous. This is called, oh gosh, please. Please forgive me, the Lichtenberg Sapphire Diamond. I'm not sure if I pronounced that right. Um, but this one is going to be number 24. All right, I'm getting back into hairs. So I found Madison Hair by Green Llamas. I'm gonna download this one because it's really, really cute. This one is going to be number 25. Oh, this is a nice little updo. This one's called Sky Hair by H ha or sorry, A Harris 00 Brittany. It looks like there's, oh, there's different versions. Ooh, I like version three. So Sky Hair is going to be number 26. Actually, A Harris Brittany is a, or is that what it is? A Harris 00 Brittany, I think. They have great hairs and I actually get a lot of their stuff. So I recommend them. And there's some new things that I haven't downloaded here yet. This one's pretty, Isabella Hair. I'm gonna download this one. So this one's number 27. All right, I'm actually back to normal Sims Tumblr because there were some that I wanted to get. I wanna get this choker. They have a, oh, they have like a headband too. I like that. Okay. Okay, this one I'm going to link. You can download whatever you want from here. They have some other tiers too. That one's number 28. Okay, here's one. It's called the Lee Address, L-E-A. I'm going to put this one here. This one's number 29. Ooh, this one's cute. This one's called Celia Dress. So this one is by Aretha B. So I'm gonna get this one and I'm going to put this as number 30. Okay, so I found this one and it's beautiful. It is very like fantasy almost. It's so, I don't even know who I'm gonna have wear this, but I think I want someone to wear it. If not for like a regular dress, maybe for a wedding dress. So I'm gonna put this one here. This one is called Delilah Wedding Dress. This one is gonna be number 31. Another page that I highly recommend going to look at is Lana CC Finds on Tumblr. I don't think I'm gonna get 
this dress because it's a little bit lower than I would want for my royals, although it is really cute. But what they have, which is great, so go to all tags, The Sims 4, and then themed CC lists. This is where I get my outfits for all of the other royals. So like they have them, well, if you saw, yeah, they have them grouped by culture. And then they have like decorating styles and uh, like just uh, color palettes, like all this stuff, history. It's really cool, like the way it is all just organized. So this is where I get a lot of my custom content for like Glimmerbrook and Oasis Springs and all that. So they have clothes, build items, hairs, just like literally anything they can find that's in that theme. So I've already downloaded most of this stuff, but if you guys saw, yeah, they just got some really cool stuff. So make sure you go check out Lana CC Finds on Tumblr if you wanna look for themed stuff as well. I think I've already gotten most of everything that I need to from here. So I'm not gonna link anything from here, but just take a look, it's amazing. Oh, and then there's this one. This one I already have, but I'm gonna put this here for you guys anyway, because I think someone was asking about it. This one's number 32. So that is called Bride's Mother's Dress. It's gorgeous for an everyday outfit for a queen. Okay, so this one's a, like a fantasy outfit for men. It's supposed to be like an elven set. I think I might be able to use this though. So this one is going to be number 33. Oh, this is a gown for a child. The Alyssa gown for the child by Sific. So I'm gonna do this one. This is cute. This this is number 34. Ooh, this one's a little, this one's kind of dark, but it, I think it's actually really cool. I'm gonna get this one too. This is called Disasso Disso Association coat. So this one, I know we don't have that much male clothing. I apologize, but I will get this one. So this one is number 35. And then I have most of these, but this is Bruxwa. So I've talked about them before in my past videos. I have other custom content videos, which I will link below as well, but they have so many great male custom content and some of the female custom content for Royals. I don't actually think I have this one. I'm gonna download this one for you guys too. So this one is going to be number 36. Here is a nice little formal princely suit for the boys. So this one is going to be number 37. Ooh, this one is called 2020 suit for the men. Ooh, I like that one a lot. I really love suits. I mean, I just dress my royals in suits like all the time. So I need a little bit more variety for all the characters. This one is called Titus wedding suit. It has a nice navy blue suit that I could definitely use for Willow Creek. So this one's going to be number 39. Oh, this one's so cute. It's called pleated skirt mini dress. This one I could definitely use for an everyday outfit for a royal. So I'm gonna make this number 40. Oh, these are pretty for Oasis Springs. I'm gonna download this. So they are two separate ones. It looks like the top and the bottom come separately. So I'm gonna make the top number 41 and I will make the bottom one num or the bottoms, the skirt. I will make that number 42. And then for our last one on BEO Creations, this transparent sleeves dress. This is really cute. This one is a RAR file, R-A-R. For this one, I download something called 7-Zip online. And then with that, you can extract RAR files and turn them into regular files. But I will link this one and put this as number 43. Okay, cool. So that's all the custom content shopping I'm gonna do today. I think that's about enough for now. So I'm gonna put all these links in a Tumblr post for you guys and link that in the description below. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope this was helpful. If it was, make sure you hit that like button. If you have not already, make sure you hit that subscribe button and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.